Guys, what's up? It's Sid, back with another video. Today, oh my god, sorry about that lighting. Okay, there we go. We are making a new tank thing for my turtle. Because it has grown out of its tank that it's in currently, and so we are going to make another one. So we're at Lowe's right now, and what we're, we got like river gravel, something big rocks right here. It's called egg rock. We got some big rocks. So uh, I was reading up on it, and um, you don't want like smaller rock like this, where your turtle can eat it. You know, if you, you feed him, and he accidentally bites down on a rock and falls and dies because he can't eat a rock. But um. So we're getting this right right here, and then we're going to run over to Target, get like one of those plastic tubs, a big plastic tub, put some water in it, maybe get a pump or a heater or something for it, and then uh, a stone or something, and we're going to get him some crickets to eat, and then we're going to get some more worms for him to eat, and now uh, we're also going to feed my koi, feed my koi in this video, and uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy. At the tubs, I don't know what we're really looking for, but maybe something like this, but a little smaller, not that deep. Because we need length more than depth. Yeah. Big Spartan, one. You think that one? <laughs> I like this one. Yeah. You like this one? I like that one. It's long. Yeah, it's long, a lot of space. Can we put some depth in it. Gonna go with that? Give that blue lid, I think. How much is that? It's not twenty dollars, is it? Is that one right now? What does it say? It's a tag set. Hefty? What is this? Is that hefty high rise? Well maybe it is. Maybe we are not going to get this one. I mean it is pretty nice. But maybe not. We'll set this down right there. Oops. Yeah, what about this one? How much is that one? Both of these are broken. Broken? Broken one? Oh, yeah, they are cracked. So it looks like we're not getting that one. I don't see anyone. Like, this is too shallow right here. I, too shallow. I like that one. I do like that one, but I like the longer ones, you know? Yeah, I do too. We don't have a room, too. Well, kind of. See, I think this is too shallow. Like, the length of my hand, yeah, it's too shallow. How much is this? How much is that? Yeah. Ten dollars? None of these. No. Ten bucks? I like this one. And then... We have that one. That one's twenty dollars, but that one's. I think that's. Just, are we gonna go with that one? Disgusting the prices. I don't know yet. See, see how deep this one is. Like we don't need it. Something. As long as my arm. Yeah. What's the difference between this one and this one? Oh, that one's the blue one's definitely the dark blue one's definitely bigger. This one's bigger. bigger, taller, and bigger. I like this one. I like this one, too. How much is this one, though? If this one's like 15, then we might as well get the big, longer one. How much? This blue one? Oh, seven bucks. Is the lid separate to come with the lid? Uh, the lid might be separate. What brand is it? It's not. It's probably either white or what brand is it? Just fit. This is too big. This is probably twice the size of what he has. Oh, easily twice the size. Alright, well, we'll see what we're gonna get, and uh, I'll get back to you guys. To go with the dark blue one. And uh, we found a lid. We found a lid for it. And we're getting, we're getting a lid because if we end up putting crickets in there, if they're totally, the crickets can't jump up, so you wake up with the crickets all over your face. You don't want that to happen. So that's why we got the lid. We're gonna poke a bunch of holes in the top of the lid. So we can breathe. Mm -hmm. Just 
working back there. But we're going to go with that, get in there. Now we need to get distilled water because the tap water here is really, really bad. It killed my fish, and I don't want it to kill the turtle. Killed one of the fi two of the fish. But uh, well, we don't want that to happen. So we're going to grab some jugs of these distilled right here. Grab one, two, three. I think six is good. I think six. Are we gonna grab some to like drink? That's good. Though? Yeah, that's good. All right, we got eight. Mm -hmm. We got eight gallons. Definitely not gonna use all eight. We have that river gravel. We're gonna put the river gravel right over here in this section, and we're gonna pour all the water in. And then we might get a plant or like something in there for him to like climb on in the water or something. But we don't know yet. But that's what we got so far. And. Uh, so you guys if you get anything else or at home okay so here's my koi tank i got one koi and then i got two koi and i have a little koi catfish down here at the bottom and i have a pleco over here on this rock right here and uh i just feed them night crawlers that's one of the best foods that you can feed for them. so what i do is i take the night crawler take it out of this package and then i wash all the slime and the dirt off of it so it doesn't cloud up the tank. And then usually, I'll just take a pair of scissors and I'll snip it right in half so I can feed one and I'll feed the other one. So here we go. Uh, I'll drop it in up top right here. Let's see. Oh, 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 look, he took it. There he goes. Now, the other one is chasing him around trying to get the worm. So if I put the other one up at top, if you see it, I'll drop it down, and there it goes, boom. It's pretty cool. And uh, that was a very small worm that I cut in half, and I could have actually, like, just fed him the whole one. So, uh, if you can see, the big one already finished his. So, I'll get another, try to get another small worm, and then I'll cut that in half. Here we go, there's another small one. I'm going to wash it off. And the other thing that the washing of the, the, your worm off does, it's, it will stun. It will actually like stun the worm because it went from being dry to wet super quick. And uh, it'll flail around less. So it won't try to like go around everywhere. So you can see if they want another one. If not, I'll just drop it in the turtle tank. See, I can put it right here. And I'll drop it down. Right in front of the big one. See if he wants it. And th there it is right there. He's going for it. He's right there. Protecting it from the other dude. He's kind of shadowing it. Once he finishes like chewing or whatever he's doing. I don't really know. But once he finishes. And since I already cut this worm in half. And uh, we're changing the turtle tank. I'll just drop it in. Uh, something for the quarry to chew on. Because they actually will quote. Uh, chew on it and uh, it'll go around the tank and if the koi want it later all they gotta do is just eat it look see the big one picked it up if you can see it right up there I don't have a name for these guys so you gotta name the big you gotta name them down in the comments below so the big one right here is real fat Fatter than other ones. He's got like some yellow and gold in him, and he's really fat, and he eats a lot. And then there's just a regular silver one right here. And it's got some blue on the top of his. So go ahead and name those for me, guys, because I don't have a name for them. And you guys can name them down in the comments below. So that was pretty cool. I hope you guys enjoyed the koi feeding. So, everything that we got from the water to the new tank and everything probably costed about twenty dollars, so it was relatively cheap. And uh, plus, we bought a lot more water than we need. But uh, here's the tank that he's in right now. As you can see, if you can, there's a turtle right here. And there he is for you guys. I'll give you guys a closer look when we get him out. But see these rocks? See how small they are? It's really not what we want. Some. That's why we got bigger rocks and a bigger tank. Here's the lid 
a bigger tank. And you can see how much bigger this space is going to be for him to move around and swim in. And that's really cool. Uh, we didn't end up getting a heater or anything. But uh, we already have a little heater in there for him and an aquatic heater. So uh, we'll eventually get a power head or something for him. But that's that. And uh, so you guys want to change out the tank. Right now we're washing off the tub just in case. The tub that we bought and the rocks just in case there's any like sand in the rocks or any small bits of rock that we don't want him to eat or anything in there. Any kind of chemicals we need to wash that all off so he can be safe. And uh, same thing with the with the plastic tub. We need to wash that off, make sure there's no dust, no chemicals or anything in it. And uh, we'll wash that off so make sure that he's safe. The first round of rocks right now in here. There we go, about two gallons of water, maybe one. Uh, but there we go, we got it in there. Rocks, more rocks to come in here. It's looking so he's got a lot of room to swim around everything. And uh, since he's so small right now, we're going to put this rock somewhere, this flat rock, so he can climb on the flat rock because these rocks are a lot bigger than I expected. So. Alright, so we just finished the little tank thing. Right here we finished it. As you can see, the giant difference between this and this over here. There's a lot more water. And there's a lot more space for him to climb around and swim around in. And uh, the water is a little cold. And that's all right. The heater. We have the heater over here next to this flat rock, and it'll it'll heat up eventually. Just gotta give it some time. And it uh, looks like he's ready to go. So let me pick him up. This is a uh, uh, snapping turtle, northeastern snapping turtle. Right here. He's about the size of my hand. So we'll put him in right now. And he's checking it out. He's like, what? What's going on? He has no clue. It's as big as he's ever been. So, looks like he really likes it. So, thank you guys for watching. And uh, leave a like on this video. And remember to leave a comment and name those two fish. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the vid of us redoing this journal tank, and uh, thank you for watching.